He's been a player and assistant, and now St. Ray's grad T.J. Sorrentine will take a run at head coach, at least for now. J.P. Smallins has more. He made his biggest mark as a player during March Madness. Now the month has taken on a whole new meaning for T.J. Sorrentine, the former Vermont standout, now Brown's interim head coach, taking over for former Catamount assistant and Bear head coach Jesse Yeagle. I'm bittersweet to say the least. Uh, Jess obviously brought me on as, as an assistant uh, four years ago and you know I'm grateful to him uh, for all that he's done for me. Um, he recruited me as a player and you know uh, I owe a, a ton to him. Um, so that was tough uh, to see him let go. And then the quick turnaround of uh, Goldie uh, naming me the interim um, was obviously an exciting time for me. Uh, you know excited about the opportunity. Uh, you know something you dream about uh, being a coach um, you know, I, I've always wanted to be a head coach, and right now I'm, I'm getting that opportunity. So uh, I'm excited and uh, just going full speed ahead. The first point of business for the St. Ray's grad, the same he held as a Brown assistant, selling the program to potential recruits as the high school recruiting period prepares to get into full swing. From a basketball standpoint, it's uh, it's tough um, because recruiting is is important, and April has opened up for uh, Division One coaches to go out and recruit. Um, so we have two weekends in, in April to to go on the AAU circuit, which is a big deal. So you know, people may ask, how, how are you going to recruit during those months? And uh, I'm uh, the same way I've recruited all, all my four years here. I'm just going to be confident, excited, sell this great university, one of the best universities in the country that you can attend. You want to come here for the school first. You want to come here for basketball second, um, but come here for the opportunity and the experience that this university will, will give you. Though it is an interim appointment, TJ is expected to be on the job for a while. Brown's athletic director Mike Goldberger is retiring at the end of June, and he expects his replacement to hire the new head coach. So Sorrentine will get a full taste of life as the head man, while also getting the chance to make an impression on the Bear staff. Just uh, bring a lot of excitement to the program. Uh, I'm a, an excited guy. I'm very positive. Um, I love this state, um, so I would love to see uh, Brown University uh, be super successful. We have a great bunch of kids. Um, I care deeply about them and their families, and uh, you know that's the most important thing. I recruited each one of these kids to come here, and uh, I would love the opportunity to see them through and just making making them to be the best men they can be. In Providence, I'm J.P. Smollins, Eyewitness Sports.